Exile base. What do you have for me? The base is comprised of two mining domes. The second can only be accessed with a passcode. I also detect multiple frequencies originating from the area. They have communication with Kadara. What does Sid think about all this? Not many miners are out of stasis. She acts like it's all right. She's still optimistic. But not stupid. <laughs> not even a little bit. You said damage to her cryo array woke her early. How early? She saw everything go down. The uprising, authority changing hands, several times. Honestly, Cora, sometimes I wonder if she keeps it together so I don't give up. Code on the door to the second dome, Pathfinder.
That takes care of cracks in it. His people. But what were they up to? I detect an audio log nearby, Pathfinder. It may give you the information you need. don't want excuses, Krex. The dust on the surface isn't enough. If I want to take these initiative colonies out, we'll need a hell of a lot more Helium-3. I know that Remnant Tiller and the Conservatory will work. Get it running. Elora out. It's that Asari from Kadara. She wanted to attack the colonies. But it sounds like they couldn't activate some sort of Remnant Tiller. Sam? I believe that console you interfaced with in the Remnant Conservatory activated the Tiller. It will expose more soil to radiation, increasing helium-3 production exponentially. If my calculations are correct, this planet could fuel Nexa ships for an estimated 368 years. With that much fuel, we could discover countless new worlds. Sam, send a message to Tan. The initiative has fuel. If Alora had mined enough helium-3 to bomb the colonies, I advise against hypotheticals, Pathfinder. I've alerted the Nexus to the situation. Patrols will be stationed around this planet to ensure the Helium-3 remains in your control. Still, when I see Alora again, we're having a chat.
picking her up. Where to next, Pathfinder? Vetra was looking for you.